Okay, okay, we're back. Welcome back, everybody. We're doing the thing. I'm gonna get the move. Springy shoes. Yeah, all right. Now it's... <laughs> I do love that it was. Oh, we need to get the spring move. Is that it? Probably yeah. Spring boots are fucking cool, dude. Oh, Weren't there a pair of shoes like right next to this thing? Or uh, was he just showing you what they look like? He was showing you what they look like. What a cunt. <laughs> He's kind of like, hey. Oh, hey, a switch. Can I hit that with the? You dig those grenade eggs, hey. Uh, I think it's because they're like one of the few eggs that has like impact. When impact. It hits. Okay. You're never gonna make it. Yeah, that's okay. There's a flight pad around here somewhere. Spring. I bet you that that's a Minjo. Like that if would I were be bullshit. if I were a game developer. Oh look, there's another egg up there. Did you see it? Yeah, but you're probably not gonna be able to hatch it yet. No. Oh look, and there's a submarine thing. Mm-hmm. Vega. What did she say there? I don't know. Vega. Bird, bird sounds. Uh. Ah. It did not look like you hit that switch. <laughs> Twelve seconds. Go go go. Where is he? In here? Yeah. Save that black Jinjo. Got him. Let's go. Oh, you can just shoot right back to Banjo? Mm hmm Good, because I didn't want Kazooie to get trapped in that cage forever. <laughs> Banjo wouldn't have been able to hit the switch. Wouldn't have ended well. Mm -hmm. What's up here? I can't remember. A honeycomb, okay. Hmm? Yeah, I have no idea. This isn't familiar. Do you think you could now swim faster than you could walk? That's a good point. I'm gonna go with probably, but... Uh-oh. Whoa, 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 I didn't like that thing. Hey, it's a move. Can I shoot him? Whoa. What the fuck? There's a thing on the wall. Oh. Oh, you killed it! Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> yeah, fuck him. Let's see. There's a rock there. Looks like one of those rocks you can bust open, but... I don't think it is. But you're probably right. You know more about this game than I. What? It's back! Quick! There was a move up there? Yeah, there was a move. Shit. Okay, let's go up. I think that's all the... So we go up on that ledge. Is that you? Oh, I see. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I saw a move. There's a split pad here. What does this say? It's exciting in the... What? Uh, I feel like he stopped using words. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. Yeah, see? Move. Let's all go. you gotta do is get by all the Venus flytraps. I hate these things. These things are so gross. I hate them a lot less now that I know that I can actually kill them. Yeah, but it's weird because some of them the game has where they're low enough that you don't always hit them. I guess. What? Oh, so this is just a banjo move. What the fuck? Just a banjo move? Yeah. Well, he can he can climb, and now that you've gotten rid of the things... Shit. Right? Yeah. I can't rightly remember what that move is. Um... Just by the fact that it's for banjo, I'm gonna judge it's pretty useless. I'm trying to remember. Maybe he'll swing another cloth bag at somebody. <laughs> I think I remember what it is. Um, I think it's a move that lets you stuff things into your backpack. Oh, so we could go carry that fat kid. Mm -hmm. Whoa, did he just jump high by himself? Yeah. Uh, fuck, I thought it was gone. Uh, I think that might have been my bad. What? Well, I think... Damn it. 
I'm, I'm pretty sure I told you that it would be safe now because I thought you already killed those things. I forgot that they respawn. That's okay. Oh yeah, we can go save McFryface. Who's McFryface? Uh, in the the lava part of the carnival world, there's that fat kid that we got to get back to his parents. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll stuff him into a backpack for sure. <laughs> like he would. Well, I guess Kazooie fits. Yeah. Yeah, taxi pack. Way to fill it with your feel like pick up the ground. <laughs> this is, this is round. Fuck! I almost had it that time. Okay. Whoa! I thought you had to, like, time that perfectly. No. I was... James, mm -hmm. I'm severely less impressed with your skills <laughs> now. I thought you were just always nailing, like, that frame-specific timing. No, it's any time during the swing. Oh. That makes me sad. I spent the last month and a half thinking my friend was so cool. I mean, you're still cool, but... We could pretend I'm still talented if you want. Did I come out of that hole, or was it this one? Was um, it, is there even a second hole in there? Well, the one that you... <laughs> Sorry, that was out of nowhere. Um, this is not the one you came in. Okay. That's what she said. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> wow, it's this is exciting though. Like it, it looks all bright and shiny, like it's the end of the movie. Oh yeah, check it out. The little shell dudes in here. He's, oh, all right. I thought they would have been interactable. That's true. Oh, and here's another one of those guys. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Fucking, why do we have to look right up his ass? <laughs> All go shape of the pair. See? But still... That's not even... That's not a phrase. <laughs> Nobody says that. <laughs> I'm going to start saying it just to piss people off. There's Humble Wumba down there. So I can go up and around this ledge. That's... Just there. What's down below me directly? Humble Wumba? Uh-huh. There's a thing over there. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> what was that? The human beatbox? Uh, what's up this way? Um. I just realized I haven't gotten like a jiggy in a yet in a while. <laughs> Have we gotten a jiggy at all in this world? Yeah, we got the one with the, the little T-Rex. Oh yeah. Where's this go? Down. Yeah, it feels like we've made a lot of progress towards almost things. Mm-hmm. I haven't gone up this way. No, we haven't. Path to nest. To Terry's nest? I think so. Should we take it? I can't get up. I need the springy boots. Can't you just jump across? You know what? I bet they're down here. Who's Fuck. that? I think I remember how to get there. Um, springy Boots is in that guy's cave, I think. I saw a couple of other Springy Boots on this level. It's a pair. Yeah, there they are. Holy shit! Shit, that didn't help. I need the Springy Boots on that side. Oh, you can only use the Springy Boots once? Yeah. Well, that's gonna hurt. Woo! I keep thinking it's going to do more damage than it does. Yeah, I don't know. It, it doesn't seem to... Like, fall damage isn't really a thing to be afraid of in this game. I think it's, like, almost exponential, though. Like, you know, a few extra meters is an extra life. Will he let us in? Maybe. Fuck you, too. We Unga Boongas want to rule... Uh, Oogles. Wait. So Unga Bungas and Oogle Boogles are different... Cavemen. But the Unga Bungas seem like the bad guys. Like, he said that the Oogle Boogles are bad, but mm -hmm. he said that they want to share. 
Oh. And well, he, he's like, we Ungamungas want to rule all Pterodactyl land. And Oogle Boogles want share. Well, they maybe, bad. Maybe he's a dick. Yeah, he's totally a prick. I know how to get back in there, though. Whoa, I remember this. You do? No, I don't. Like, have we been Fuck. in here yet? Come on, man. Sorry. You're better than that. I need all the honeys. There's only two? Okay. <laughs> oh, well, I mean, that's... It's fair. It's yeah. as many as he took from you. This rock looks breakable. Oh, oh, it's a... Oh. Oh, but Kazooie can jump higher by herself. Yeah. God, her feet are so gross looking. Whoops. Whoa, and she almost died. Him. Here we go. Whoa. Check it out. It's Sarah. <laughs> From the land before time? Yeah. What so, did she just say about shit? She said she was feeling sick. What did he say? Tiny Sarah. I'm Boo. So small. Boo All the girls laugh at me. <laughs> I feel you, man. <laughs> We've all been there. Mumbo. Okay. Oh, uh, we can make him big with Mumbo. Mm -hmm. So that the girls won't laugh at him. Yeah. And then he can... Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to go to a dark place there. <laughs> Her name is Scrat. Mm -hmm. Oh, but we can use the the train exactly to get her to the doctor. Exactly. James, I'm putting some stuff together in my head. That's why I really like this dinosaur quest because it kind of tied in with a lot of other shit. Like you brought the one, you bring the one back from the from the freak show and the carnival. The missing one back. And then you take the sick one to go get healed and then bring it back. We got Scrit, we got Scrit, Scrat, and Scrut. Yep. I gotta find the train station in here, though. I opened the gate for it, but I don't know where it actually is. This dinosaur looks like, um... Did you ever watch the TV show Dinosaurs? Uh, I have not the mama? Because we established that rubbery looking puppets freak me out. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. But, um, Dad Dinosaur <laughs> looks like the the main character of the show Dinosaur's work boss. They had one episode sold where, like, you know what? We might have even talked about this fucking episode <laughs> on the show before. But, yeah, there was one episode where, um, there were these two mammal. Uh, little things and they were considered delicacies for all the dinosaurs like they were all the dinosaurs favorite food like they ate them yeah um but these two little mammals they were endangered and uh the main star of the show's daughter wanted she was going all like hippie vegan and mm -hmm. she wanted to save them so she kidnapped them and she was like hiding them from the rest of the dinosaur world that wanted to pay a lot of money to eat the last two things alive <laughs> and it was kind of dark well and it was this it was um this really like profound episode of like trying to save wildlife mm -hmm. from being over farmed kind of thing and then at the end of the episode uh by, like by the end of the episode the main character he he has started to grow like an affiliation for these things because he realizes that they're not just food and that they like they've grown to love him kind of thing oh. and so he wants to protect them and him and his boss have this huge heartfelt moment and his boss has a change of heart as well and so he like he his boss is a pretty powerful person he gives them to his boss under his protection yeah and then as he leaves his boss's work trailer you just hear him fucking <laughs> eating these things it was the dark no like, it broke my heart when i was a kid it was the darkest thing i've ever seen in my entire life that's brutal dude No, we definitely never talked about that before. Oh, Humba's gonna be huge now. Yeah. She's gonna have a big old booty. Where's that? I bet you Mumbo wants to get like all up in that now. Oh, probably. 
I'm gonna go enlarge that. Oh yeah, that baby dinosaur. Baby dinosaur over here. And then I think we'll call that a sesh. Yeah. Is, am, I going, am, am I even going the right way? Oh yeah. That was the most exciting 10 seconds of my life. <laughs> like, I think when you said, we'll call that a sesh, like my brain just checked out and I actually sat staring at the TV, just open mouthed and not saying a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, uh, the thing never respawned. That's weird. What thing? The jerkish honeycomb thing. Oh yeah. Oh, there it goes. Noodle loop. There you go, now he can get all the attention he needs. Now he can fucks. Like, all things considered, I bet you that would be incredibly painful. <laughs> <laughs> just every cell in your body just expands. All your bones just growing ah! extra. <laughs> oh god! Ah! <laughs> cool. Alright, do we get a thing for it? Nah. We have to do all three for him to give us one jiggy? Yeah. This one, you gotta earn the jiggies. What a needy fuck. Alright, we're gonna do all that on the next episode. See you next time. Goodbye. Um, mm -hmm. I think there's a... I, I just, I don't feel like they need, they needed to make him wear shorts. I would have believed that he was, <laughs> that he was Banjo without them.